Hello, San Francisco voters and neighbors. For those of you who don't yet know me, my name is Amy Farrow Weiss, and I'm running for mayor of San Francisco. I may not be the candidate that you were expecting, but after learning more about my values, qualifications, and strategic proposals, hopefully you will help me win the 2015 mayor's race as a people-powered candidate. With ranked choice voting, you can vote for three candidates for mayor. Two other candidates and I have formed a coalition to vote one, two, three to replace the current mayor. No matter who you vote for, join me and a growing local movement in supporting the inclusive, culturally enriching, and sustainable development we want for our city and economy. Join the city and nonprofit workers of SEIU 1021 and a growing list of groups who have endorsed my campaign, including the SF Tenants Union, SF Green Party, and number one endorsements from SF Women's Political Committee, Richmond District and District 8 Democratic Clubs, and the Brownie Mary Democratic Club. You can visit my website at thinktwicevotewice.com at any time to view me in action at hearings, rallies, and endorsement meetings, discussing such important topics as Clean Power SF, CCSF, enforceable Airbnb legislation, a pro-worker economy, inclusive and sustainable development, protections for tenants and culturally enriching organizations, and proposals to support and grow our African-American population. I am a Bay Area native, born in Berkeley, raised in San Jose. My parents both worked union jobs, and I was the first generation of my family to go to college. After nearly a decade of working in the nonprofit sector as a service provider, educator, researcher, and public speaker in the fields of transitional housing, mental health, public health, and youth development, I moved to San Francisco in 2007 for a job as a sustainability strategist to support the triple bottom line of people, planet, and equitable profit within large corporations. I earned an interdisciplinary master's degree in organizational development from SF State in 2010. After graduating, I initiated and developed an award-winning community service learning project in the public administration department that connects community-based nonprofits with graduate student teams in support of strategic planning, communications, and evaluation for their mission-serving programs. I became activated in local politics in early 2011 when I joined my District 5 neighbors at City Hall to organize against a Chase Bank that displaced two local businesses without due process. I learned San Francisco's zoning codes, spoke at the Board of Appeals, and worked with neighbors and supervisors to protect neighborhood culture and independent businesses. In 2011, I began saying yes in my backyard to inclusive, culturally enriching, and sustainable development when I founded Neighbors Developing Divisadero. As director of this community-based nonprofit, I led a participatory planning process to revitalize a blighted historic theater, worked with citywide networks to reactivate a dormant community garden, and encouraged policy for housing affordability. If elected, I will treat the eviction, displacement, and housing affordability crisis like a true crisis. I will strengthen protections for tenants from displacement, start implementing cost-effective solutions for interim housing support to homeless neighbors, and implement new strategies for investment and development that will enable San Francisco to increase housing affordability and ultimately speed up the entitlement and construction process. Want to learn more? Ask local media to interview me about my analysis of the current housing crisis, my St. Francis Super Bowl homelessness challenge, and my proposal to prevent evictions that our current mayor himself has shown an interest in exploring. As mayor, I will support the development of community-serving, sustainable pro-worker jobs and industries that link our unemployed residents and public education graduates with livelihoods that support the greater good. I have a particular interest in making San Francisco a national leader in industries that support a balanced climate. The Black Lives Matter movement should be a key issue in all current political races. The African American population has declined to under 5% in San Francisco, while over 50% of arrests are made within this small population. We need to create pathways to prosperity rather than pipelines to prison for our African American youth. I also advocate for the development of cost-effective unarmed programs that reduce crime and increase neighborhood well-being. The mayoral election is the perfect time to explore strategic and innovative approaches to achieve important safety, sustainability, and livability outcomes for our neighborhoods and city. Let's start repairing and steering the ship of local government rather than having to bail water out of lifeboats. Let's create the political will to strategically integrate the spirit of St. Francis into San Francisco policies. And let's get excited about the sustainable future of the city we live in and love by electing people-powered leadership. Let's make history, San Francisco. Vote one, two, three to elect a people-powered candidate. Think twice, vote twice.